from prom court to the concert band and orchestra, an orchestra concert. <laughs> We've, We've got, got the scoop. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready? Begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Centurions. I'm Leonardo Tiz. And I'm Bella Sergi. And we're coming to you live from the Intel Scoop Studio. Today is May 16, 2018, only 14 days away until graduation seniors. So be sure to make the best of your last two weeks as a high school student. But Bella, I'm catching major senioritis. I just want to I just want the school year to be over. Leo, what's senioritis? Well, it's kind of like hard to explain, but luckily I have a short documentary on senioritis that could show you. I could show you. All right then, let's take a look. Unfortunately, it's that time of the year again. It's second semester, time is running out, and they are slowly starting to go one by one. Nobody knows what it is. Nobody knows the cause. I want answers. We have a big problem on our hands. From the data I've collected, it would appear that the school is secreting hormones infecting all the seniors. Where do these toxins come from? Anywhere. The walls around us, lockers, even the computers. I knew we should have went mad. Seniors are disappearing. First period becomes fifth period. Tests become art projects. And classes become nap time. I need you to promise me that nothing will change. I can't do that. Stop trying to be a hero. You're fighting a lost cause. Fighting for us. You have to be willing to give up everything. All that you know. Your friends, your family, your teachers, your GPA. understand senioritis is when high school students go through a decline in motivation and performance towards the end of their senior year absolutely and I'm definitely catching it right about now but Leo you shouldn't be discouraged at all seniors this is the time to push through those last finals boost your grades and enjoy these last two weeks as much as possible you only have one senior year so make the best of it you're right Bella I need to start working harder for the rest of the year good to hear JK <laughs> Moving on into some important prom news. The last day to purchase your prom ticket is this Friday. Tickets are $90 with an ASB card and $95 without. Both juniors and seniors can attend this prom. And remember that you don't just have to go with a date, you can go with your friends or your squad and it will still be an amazing night. Yeah, you're right. Speaking of prom, I don't think we've announced who's running for prom yet. You're right, Leo. <laughs> For our queens, we have Kate Bustamante, an inside scoop member who is on varsity volleyball, varsity track, and varsity basketball. She is also a member of the eBusiness Academy. She's a fashionista, down to earth, and isn't afraid to be herself. Next, we have Sofia Leal, 
who was a varsity cheerleader and, w and was also involved in the e-business academy. She's a little shy, but is also one of the sweetest people you will ever meet without great, with a great personality and love for shoes and music. She will be, she'll, she'll be running the world one day. Up next is Daisy Cruz. She is in varsity cheer and is another member of the Evis Academy. She's actively involved with ASB and is also a member of NAC. She's an animal lover and obsessed with boba. She's an amazing friend and loves spending her time on cute little adventures. Last but not least, we have Ariana Radia. She is in both varsity volleyball, varsity soccer. She's, she's a great leader, extremely positive and incredibly outgoing. She's a makeup guru and lovely person to be around. You will never have a bad moment with her. Now it's time for our kings. First we have Jason Jacobo, Brian Diaz, Danny Alvarado, and <laughs> Jodeci Ponkingfam. <laughs> <laughs> Jason is a strong noble and a great dancer. He was also involved in ASB and wrestling, varsity wrestling. Danny Alvarado is our ASB president, was involved in lots of community events, and he is also attending UCLA in the fall. Yes, next we have Brian Diaz. Brian Diaz is very proud of his music videos that he has produced. <laughs> he, is, he was part of the E-Business Academy and was, and was a runner-up for the um, century, Mr. Century thing with Jigger. <laughs> Jodeci Ponkenham is a great photographer. He loves his girlfriend, and he was also involved in varsity football and varsity track. All right. Um, well, we have amazing candidates, so make sure you're going to prom and vote for them there. You're right, Leo. If you want to see who wins prom queen and king, make sure to buy your tickets ASAP and attend prom on May 25th. Today, we have some orchestra members in the studio to talk about their upcoming concert. Take it away, Kate. Hi guys, I'm here today with two phenomenal musicians, Douglas Torres and Danny Alvarado. Tell me guys, who are your graduating seniors? Alright, so for orchestra, we have Chris Cabrera, Diana Cardenas, Milagros Cruz, Melissa Romero, and Emmanuel Hernandez. And for band? And for band, we have Francisca Nava, Perla Moreno, uh, Daniel Martinez, Adrian Hernandez, Douglas Torres, and myself, Daniel Alvarado. And when will this concert be taking place? It'll be taking place tomorrow at 7 p.m. in the TCC, so make sure to show up. And what time should Centurions get there to get a good seat? Make sure to get there by like 6.30 to get really good seats. Well, that's all, Centurions. Back to the anchors. Vote for us for Prime Court. Fine. <laughs> Remember to attend Orchestra's performance tomorrow at 7. Admission is free. Yeah, it sounds like it's going to be packed, actually, so I better get there early. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Centurions, that's all we have for you on today's broadcast. But remember, together, together we, we can achieve, achieve more. more. Bye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>